God says today, if you love me, then don't skip this video and watch this video till the very end. So I choose to walk this path with courage and conviction, knowing that I am guided by a presence that knows no bounds, a presence that whispers words of encouragement and strength into the depths of my soul. And as I journey onward, I am filled with a sense of peace and assurance in knowing that I am exactly where I am meant to be, guided by the hand of the divine. In closing, I invite you to join me on this journey of self-discovery and spiritual awakening together. Let us embrace the truth that lies within and let us walk boldly into the light of divine grace and mercy, for in the presence of the divine, all things are possible, and miracles abound for those who dare to believe. May you be blessed abundantly as you embark on this sacred journey, and may the presence of the divine illuminate your path and guide you ever onward towards innerful fulfillment and divine purpose dot with love and light. In the depths of your soul I reside, a constant presence that transcends time and space today. I invite you to reflect upon the essence of our connection, to explore the intricate tapestry of our relationship through your own words. To those engulfed in darkness, I am the beacon of light that illuminates their path, guiding each step with unwavering grace and renewal for those consumed by thirst. I am the spring of living water, flowing from celestial realms to quench the parched depths of their souls, offering solace to their weary hearts. To the hungry, I am the bread of life, nourishing their spirits and fortifying their resolve amidst the trials of existence. To the afflicted, I am the healer of ailments, the harbinger of strength that sustains their hope in the face of adversity. But who am I to you, beloved, in the quiet moments of introspection, that your heart speak freely, unburdened by doubt or hesitation, to the lonely, I am the steadfast listener, attuned to the whispers of their innermost struggles, offering solace and companionship in their darkest hours. To the weary, I am the source of respite, lightening the burdens that weigh heavily upon their shoulders, infusing their spirits with the courage to persevere. To the sinner, I am the harbinger of redemption, the embodiment of forgiveness that knows no bounds. I offer sanctuary to those who seek refuge within the shelter of my love, extending a hand of mercy to all who dare to embrace the promise of transformation. For you, dear one, I am the embodiment of eternal love a beacon of unwavering devotion that transcends the trials of mortal existence. Your dedication to our communion is a testament to the depth of your faith, a radiant reflection of the love that dwells within your heart. As you navigate the labyrinth of life, remember that your actions speak volumes echoing the sentiments of devotion that resonate within the recesses of your soul.